Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing something very exciting. I went ahead and got a Hank and Henry mystery box. I got the number three, which was a $77 one, and we are going to go ahead and unbox that. And afterwards we are going to put whatever I got in there on my face. I did go ahead and put some foundation on, did some contour, and did my brows because I know those things will not be in the box. But let's get started. I did have to go ahead and undo the tape because it came all fudged up and stuff. So I know I should be getting six full size items from this box. Plus a bunch of this. Should have put a trash can over here. Would have been a good idea. Alright, so the first thing I'm grabbing out of here is. What is this? Party Girl. What is this? A lipstick? If I can get it opened. Yeah, it's a uh, pink matte liquid lipstick. Ooh, I like liquid lipsticks. And the next thing I see in here is a highlighter. <laughs> oh, um, definitely was not expecting this. So the highlighter is in the shade of Super Nova. And as you can see, it's very pink. I am sensing a theme with my box. <laughs> this is going to be a fun look. Okay, so the next thing I got is a Neon Loose Pigment. Let me guess, is it pink? It is, it is. Flamin' Flamingo. This is going to be a absolutely wonderful, wonderful look today. Definitely not clowny at all. Okay, and the next thing is a long wear liquid eyeliner in, oh, something not pink, but it is a blickety blue. So the next thing that we have is the Teddy palette. Let's see what that looks like. The very last thing we have in the box is another palette. It is the Poison eyeshadow palette. And these are the colors inside. Okay, so that is absolutely everything in the box. Now it's time to somehow make a look with all of this bright ass pink shit. See the excitement on my face? It's there. Oh shit. Okay. Let's start everything off with the look for today, the crazy ass look that's gonna be. We're just going to go in with Anthrax to do that, you know, base shade that I like to do. And Anthrax is the white color. We are going to, um, and oh, and the Anthrax was in the Poison palette. I mean, that makes sense, but, you know, just a FYI. Next thing I'm going to go into is from the Teddy palette is the Bare Necessities. 
and that is going to be for like the crease kind of transition shade. <laughs> kind of do the crease transition shade whatever you want to call it out I am wiping the brush off just a little bit and then going into it for right under like my eyebrow right above the transition shade I'm going to go in with a barely there So I pretty much just went with the bare necessities and kind of just did it up a little bit because the other one was just a little too, too much. Um, but now we are going to go into some crazy shit. So, because yeah. we are going to start out with this yellow neon color. Because the loose eyeshadow is a very neon pink, so we want something to kind of go together with it. You know? I am using my new Luxie brush from my birch box. We may end up having to do, um, by putting some setting spray on the brushes to get it to stick, but I'm gonna go in with the yellow just to see first if that's even needed. I think it's a definitely needed because that is not looking um neon yellow at all. Alright now it's wet so hopefully it goes on a lot better. Oh it really does not. It doesn't look like it does in the thingy. I don't know. Well hopefully it ends up fine. I don't think it is. I think this is going to look stupid. I'll be back when I'm done. This is going to take a second. Okay, so that yellow was um, a nightmare and I have a feeling that this pink is going to be even more of a nightmare because I've never used a loose eyeshadow before. Oh my god. Probably wetting the brush is something you definitely have to do with loose ones. Or maybe I'm just stupid and don't know what I'm doing. And that's, that's most likely it. Now with this one, the powder under my eyes, it's definitely a very good thing. Because if not, this shit would be everywhere. And probably impossible to get off. Let's see... Any. Looking better on this side than the other. That's typically what happens. One looks okay, the other one looks like shit. At least when it comes to me doing makeup, that's how it usually works. So I have uh, some liquid blue eyeliner like I was showing earlier. I don't really use liquid eyeliner much, so I'll figure out a way to use it that works for me. Okay, so... I'm going to try to put the stuff on here so I can just move it around and maybe that will work. Yeah, it's doing something. Okay, so I'm done with the blue eyeliner underneath and now I am going to go in a little bit with the cyan eyed right here. Just trying to kind of give it a little bit of a shimmery underneath a little bit. I went in with that and got it shimmery. And for the like little area right here, I'm going to go in with Night Shade. I may have went just a tiny bit crazy with it. I did my mascara and for the first time ever, I did not make a mess of it. So that's cool. 
I did go ahead and put some black eyeliner just on the waterline there just to make everything pop just a little bit. And I used the um, original nipple balm for my lips before I put any of the lipstick on. And it says luscious lips and glossy bits. So you can actually use it on your nipples too. So it's not as misleading as I thought at first. But the next thing we're going to do is go in with the stuff that's going to make me <laughs> look crazy. Uh, well, first, let me get all this shit off under my eye. Okay, I'm ready to humiliate myself. Okay, this isn't working. It's not really doing anything. It's like barely there. I mean... I guess that's kind of good because I won't look too crazy, but. This more looks like some pink, not actually a highlighter though. Okay, it's okay at the top of the eye under the eyebrow. But like right here, it just barely looks like a highlighter. Okay, it's looking like a highlighter right there, probably because of that stuff I have on my lip. Pink highlighter is done. Now it's time for the pink lipstick. Because we are pink crazy today. It smells weird. Okay, so now we are completely done with this odd pink crazy look. I don't know if I can go out in this. Maybe a little too crazy for people to handle. Thanks, Hank and Henry. I appreciate it. I think it's a little too much. A little crazy. I want to leave a comment down below and tell me what you think. And please like this video, share, and don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications. I will see you guys again next week. You have a great rest of your day. Bye.